Often patients have the pressure in their sinuses because the sinus openings over time have narrowed. Uh, this may be due to allergies or uh, past infections. The tissue becomes swollen and when it's treated it doesn't go all the way back down to normal. Most patients with sinus problems have tried multiple over-the-counter medicines including decongestants, allergy pills. Uh, many have already tried nasal sprays uh, prescribed by their family doctor. Uh, when they continue to have sinus pain or pressure, frequent infections, uh, pain with flying, those are all reasons to uh, consider more evaluation. In the past when someone needed sinus surgery, we needed to remove tissue in order to open up the sinuses. And sometimes this is still required if patients have polyps or a lot of diseased tissue. But for many patients, we can open up the sinuses without removing tissue. Balloon surgery is one technique of sinus surgery, and it's a lesser invasive technique, which means that the patients have less bleeding, less pain. Patients don't require packing, which uh, decreases uh, the amount of discomfort that they have after surgery. Uh, this procedure can be done uh, even in an office setting under local anesthesia, so it, it is much less invasive, and this is done with a small catheter. It's advanced into the sinuses. Uh, there's a light which will actually glow within the sinus. And then we can expand that opening with a balloon. We irrigate the sinus and then we remove the balloon. Patients often ask if they'll have any bruising after the surgery, but really no one can tell that you had surgery after you have a balloon procedure. There's no bruising, there's no swelling. Patients find that after surgery uh, they'll have less infections less pain, less pressure when they do have an infection. Uh, antibiotics will work faster so they don't have as much discomfort for as long. The balloon procedure is meant to be a long-term solution. Uh, the studies done early on when this technology was new show that the openings stay open at two years approximately 95% of the time. So it, it's meant to be a long-lasting procedure.